Put these guys on a boat. Send them over here. And then maybe we'll recruit enough men to strike at their last castle. And then we'll own a good deal of Shikoku. Should be a nice prize. see. Apparently my ships take attrition damage here. Interesting. It's because they have what looks like um, coastal defenses. That's pretty cool. here. We'll combine into one giant force. So, can I... Yes, I can. So, Japan looks like it's pretty evenly divided at this point. Once I finish off uh, the Tosa clan. We'll have a pretty united force against the Shogunate. And I also gotta take this dead random island here. Nope. Looks like they might be getting troops to try and retake their castle. Better recruit some more men there. Just for safety, of course. Guessing that general appears here. Yes, he does. I'd like to send him over here. Because Bingo is definitely turning into a nice mustering point for most of my forces. We sail for glory! Disembarking. Or if I can. Hide here. Drop anchor. Them down. And then we'll be at our enemy's base soon. Oh, I should also just recruit a couple line infantry. Just to be safe. And it couldn't hurt in any future battles. Oh no, he's veering off to try and defend his capital. I wonder if he'll make it in time. I was hoping I could ambush him and kill him. But I guess not. At your service. Waiting for a new course. Forward, men. Uh, 
All right, and we can just uh, we can just auto resolve this. Well, well, we lost lots of spear levies and a couple yard catchy. Oh, a foreign veteran. I should hire. Can I ha hire one of those? No, I can't do. Let's do that. I say, what, what? <laughs> it's like you're just doing it just to be stereotypical. Good, good sir, good sir. Governor. Sorry. Just, I just imagine English people saying that incessantly. And Chim Chim Chiru, of course. It's, uh, it's just what English people do, right? It's just their thing. You know, say Chim Chim Chiru a lot. And Governor. And, uh... Run out of English stereotypes here. What the hell? Why did it zoom in on that ship? I haven't the, the faintest idea. But that doesn't matter. Oh, what's this? Our clan goes stronger. Our clan goes strong, ever loyal to the Emperor. In recognition of our long ser service, you've been promoted to Chancellor of State. You may now appoint a general to the Chief Office of Staff. Yes, I would definitely like to. And from here, what can we recruit? What is, uh, Kihetai? Um... Kihetai are line infantry armed with their deadly modern rifles. The men have been tra well, trained to deliver disciplined volleys into enemy, f enemy uh, formations. Oh, I can also recruit vo revolver cavalry. Cavalry. I can recruit all sorts of awesome troops now. So let's see what the difference is between them. Range, reload skill. Uh, they, they can reload faster and have more accuracy, it seems. Right. Advisor, gentlemen, part time rogue, and at your service. With pleasure, sir. So, what exactly can a foreign veteran do? Uh, that's not what I want. I want to know what a foreign veteran can do. Ah, fuck it. Alright, so we've... Claimed a pretty nice place here. Carved ourselves out a nice area in Shikoku. Oops. I wish I had more, like, epic battles to show everybody, but now all the wars we were fighting are over. And we've won them all. Now we're pulling in a ton of money per turn. Uh, we, get, we got all sorts of new cool units that we get to use in our next fights. And I know the perfect testing ground.
clan abandons the Imperial cause. That's not good. These guys. These guys who used to be our allies and our friends have abandoned the Imperial cause. Unacceptable. Where's my fleet? So I can't really recruit anything here. We'll get uh, our revolver cavalry suited up. Let's get uh, some new infantry. Let's definitely quickly put some men in defense here because I know they're going to be declaring war very, very shortly. So we're going to need to send men, materials, yes, my to Kyushu in order to prepare for the coming storm. Ready for further orders. Immediately. Send men to Huga. Without delay. Drop anchor. Get those two units from Tosa, and then we'll be good to go. To rage a bitter war on Kyushu, that I think will win quite easily. But I gotta make sure that uh, the strait between uh, the mainland and Kyushu uh, is guarded because they can use that as a back door to try and get at us. So I'm going to take our new army with some new toys to play with. Ah, oh, crap. Well, my sword for you, my lord. As you wish, my lord. Apparently, uh, ready Tosa is not ready to be completely abandoned yet. So let's uh, put some levy infantry there. As you, command, as you wish. Send this main army to the capital at Nagato. Without delay. We must press a wine. Where well, I don't have many recruitment centers because I moved most of my recruitment centers towards the mainland and Shikoku. Which is not good. So, let's see what we can build there in terms of recruitment centers. Um, dick. So, that's wonderful. We've got lots of traditional units here. that I can recruit. But I don't want to rely exclusively, eh, exclusively on just like mass armies of friggin Levy infantry anymore. We must rest a while.
So I've got a plan where my best attacks are going to come from. Recruit a shinobi to do some scouting. Take the army that's on here. Full speed ahead. Our voyage is done. Ready for orders. Oh. All hands on deck. It's actually not what I wanted to do. I want the, these guys to go down here. Not uh, northward. Yeah, screwed up my fleet distribution. Actually, that could work. There they go. We are. Okay, so. Tons of levy infantry to hold this this uh, castle again. Hopefully, lightning will strike twice and we'll be able to hold it. So, who joined our enemies? These guys. Come, let us take. I'm honored to receive you. It is always a good day. So, who are the guys who backstabbed me? The Saga Clan. You bastards. Fortunately, I saw their plan a mile away. And I was able to counter them pretty quickly. Wow. Well, I think that province might be a lost cause. Yes, my my spirit hunger for blood. Them down. Ready for order. Ooh, I can build something here. Alright, build a cadet school, which will help us in terms of defending and recruiting. 
man, they've got huge armies coming in right here. There's, I, I mean, I'm gonna try my best to defend that castle. But of course, we're not gonna be able to make any promises. So beauty, beautiful. This could be uh, me totally overextending myself to try and get more provinces. Or I could, uh, or it could turn out beautifully. One of the two. We'll have to see what their next move is. But if I can effectively sweep them from the north, that would be uh, wonderful, but uh, yeah, this is uh, this is not looking so good. I mean, uh, <laughs> I was able to defend this territory last time, but uh, I don't know how good my chances are this time, considering I've got less men and they have more. But that doesn't mean I will not fight to the last. I will fight to the last man, the last drop of blood, and take as many of these bastards as I can with me. So I have arranged my troops in, in a way um, where basically my objective was to always, or to try and always have a unit of men which would give covering fire to the unit below them. So effectively trying to make sure that, that the enemies always have gunfire raining down on their head. I'm going to try the, to make this as difficult as I possibly can for our enemies. And uh, what the hell? We have like Mongolian horse archers coming in and they're doing a crap ton of damage. You know what? I don't. I'm not gonna listen to your piece of shit advice right now. Jesus Christ! These these archers are slaughtering my men. Okay. Well, now they're getting off. Crap. Now I can see why bowmen are so expensive. A tower has fallen into enemy hands. I got a fall back. I can do what I can for these guys. I can't 
do anything against these goddamn archers. Oh man, and now the samurai Kachi are blitzkrieging us. Oh, it's a disaster. Oh man, there's nothing we can do. Oh, pull everybody back. Pull them all back. Uh, the bows are slaughtering us. Oh man! Oh Jesus Christ! Slaughterhouse! Oh my God! No! No! Sir, reports have it that your tower is in enemy hands. You know what? Those reports are bullshit. Wow, we're we're not even gonna make a dent in these guys. There there's they're just their samurai Kachi just came in and blitzkrieged us. The men have taken an enemy tower. There's, there's nothing we could do. Well, maybe if we're lucky, we can kill these Bokachi. Or cut or Boki, sorry. Kachi are the infantry. There's just overwhelming hordes. They're just, there's no, there's no stopping them. Well, keep climbing up, guys. The more guys that climb up, the more at least we'll die falling off. Isn't that, isn't that great, you know? message to say to your men. Well, there's not much else I can say to him. Your general is under attack. Yeah, he is. Well, at least we got rid of those Boki. At least we might be able to kill, uh, kick the crap out of that one segment of line infantry. You guys can uh, fire at any time. That'd be great. I'd love it. You know, do something, anything, I don't care. are Kisho Ninja? Why are there ninjas attacking the castle? What the hell is that? 
Holy crap! God, they're swarming in everywhere. everybody back to the castle square to make sure that nobody is able to get out of this fight alive everyone is going to stand on the square and fight till there's no one until there's you know nothing left to fight for anymore I mean, the longer we can drag this out, the more of them will die climbing up the uh, side of the me siding, uh, uh, climb up the, s yeah, more of them will die climbing up the sides of the castle. Gone. A whole unit is lost. Yeah, well, that'll do that, or war will do that. It's almost over, but, you know, given the circumstances, I think we gave them hell. fought to the virtually to the last man and there was no surrender there was no falling back the last men are like trying to hold the stairwell against all odds But it's all over. Oh, there's... Well, only six men. Or four men. Uh, didn't die by the end of that battle, but they probably died very shortly after. So, by the end of the battle, the enemy had lost 1,450 men. I lost all 1,600 of mine, but it was nearly one for one, which, uh, when, giving su when given such overwhelming force, it's not bad. Hopefully that'll make our enemies think twice. It'll let them know that it's not going to be a cakewalk. And the war for Kyushu is going to be one hard-fought battle. Alright, well, let's uh, merge these guys together. 
and have them take this territory We still took it. Alright, we're gonna have to... Alright, so... We can tell the enemy, we've now managed to purge the clan, what, what are these clan? The, uh, Fu, uh, Fukaoka. We've managed to purge them from the north of Kyushu. And now we have to push them south. With everything we got. Where's my fleet? Should have had it come in and, and bombard these guys. But if they come, we can use the fleet to defend uh, Bungo. So, and recruit infantry here. Recruit infantry here. When we can, bring troops from Tsukushi down to Higo. There's not much we can do for, for Bungo, except hopefully it'll be able to hold out on its own. It's got their own general. Oh, he's upgraded. Twice. Or, or two upgrades. Ooh, we can... Night battles. So hopefully, this general can oversee a successful defense here. He has good troops. He has good troops to help defend. And um, there will be more pouring in as time goes on. Hopefully allowing us to stage a good defense of this, of this area. So we'll see what their armies are going to do, whether or not they're going to continue to move in synchrony, or if they're going to try and break off and each one is going to try and take it, uh, another castle. But we'll just end this turn, and we'll see what their plans are. And then I'll have to end this let's play for now. they come. Hey, how about that? What does their fleet consist of? We don't know. Ready for orders. So, I know that they're moving up to Bungo. Bungo. However you want to say that. In any case. Whew. So where are these gentlemen going? We have no idea. I should launch a... Countermeasure against them. So we've got two generals trying to lead the war in Kyushu. But, we're going to have to stop this for now. So, I want to thank you guys for watching. This has been Joseph Eastrunner with Stalin. Signing off for now, and I will see you guys next time.